All right. Come in closer to the chicken instead of just all meat. <laughs> okay, we'll start with the wishbone. Wishbone, usually right at the top and then down the side. So usually you can feel it. I'm not really, there it is. Okay, I can feel it. I scrape to try to expose it. This is not coming easy because there it is. It's a little frozen. It's already broken. It's broken, that's why I'm having a hard time. Seven years ago? Yeah. Seven years ago? I thought some year. <laughs> I don't want any bad luck. I don't believe in bad luck. I, I believe you make like your own luck. Right? It's your face. See, now that she said that, she's going to I think if you're good, luck is it'll either, come what right say, back to you. Luck is the intersection of planning and, uh, and opportunity. Good planning so there and we go. Wishbone. Okay? I'm cutting and I'm trying to be careful to keep the skin covering my breast and my thigh as much as possible. So I'm trying to kind of equal it out here. And then I like to pop these out, okay? And that makes it lay nice and flat. Now I'm gonna go ahead and remove the wing. Where's my wing? Where's my other wing? Okay. And now there's two different ways you can do this. You can start with the leg and the thigh, or you can do the breast. It doesn't really matter. It does not really matter. You can do whatever you're most comfortable with. I'm gonna go ahead and start with the leg and thigh. So I've popped my joint here already so that I take it back. And I, I put it up onto its side and I identify where is the oyster. I can see the oyster is this little piece of skin that kind of pops up right here in the back. If at all possible, you wanna get that. You're gonna have a lot better luck getting that if you have a bony knife. A chef knife is gonna be really hard because the, the end of the blade is too wide. So I'm gonna take my knife and I'm gonna go all the way back here, all the way to the backbone, and scoop up that oyster. Now, I find where my joint is and I'm hugging the backbone as much as possible and come down and I wind up with my oyster attached to my thigh, which is exactly what you wanna have. And then do the same thing on the other side. What exactly is the oyster again? Like it is the most delicious piece of meat. Amazing piece of meat on the <laughs> chicken. Next time you get a Costco rotisserie chicken, find the oyster and you will be like okay this is gold so now <laughs> it's, it's a pink gold i identify where the keel bone is and i'm going to make a cut straight down again you want to be kind of careful that you're keeping the skin intact as you do this and so now i've exposed one side so now i kind of let the meat fall and i'm going to take my knife and i'm going to scrape and get as much of the meat off the carcass as possible. Going along the spine? Going along the, um, the breast bones. Uh, okay, so there's my the breast. The ribs are here on this side. So then I'm gonna take my knife. Kind of peel it back. It's a little frozen, so it's... It's freezing my little fingers off. All right. Make sure your knife, is, this, this could use a little tune-up. Make sure your knife is nice and sharp. Okay, so now we have nice, clean carcass. Ideally, this is what we're looking at. Nice and clean, you know. As much meat, yeah, I could have done a little bit better on that. Okay. So now, to remove my leg and thigh, I find this little line of fat here. And so I cut right down and expose that joint. And then you can just open the joint up and then stick your knife. It's like throwing chicks on the rim. This one's kind of loose. There it is. And go right in between, okay? And then you have your leg and your thigh. If you have a really nice sharp knife, you can just cut in between these joints without going between them. You can cut the, cut the um, through the bone. And that is acceptable too, as long as your knife is sharp and you're not leaving splinters of, you know, bone behind. But and that's separating the what from the leg? That cut that you just did. The leg from the thigh. Like, yeah. Okay? Okay. All right. Thanks. Will you send that to me? Yes. Bye, everyone. Bye. Have a great day.